your KRCG 13 Storm Vision Forecast with Zach Paul. Well, it's going to be another chilly night. We'll find a few clouds across the area. Temperatures slowly falling through the 20s. It'll be a fairly slow fall through the 20s. As you can see, temperatures in the mid to upper 20s as we get through the 10 o'clock hour, then slowly falling into the low 20s by early tomorrow morning. Wind chills will be in the teens here this evening and through the early morning as well. It's going to be a cold start to your Tuesday. However, it looks like we'll find a little bit more sunshine going through the day tomorrow. In the meantime, clouds have been locked in here through most of the day, finding a little bit of clearing skies north of I-70, even a few areas of some light snow flurries down across the southeast towards the boot hill. Otherwise, pretty quiet conditions here around mid-Missouri. Your temperatures here at 5 o'clock, definitely on the cold side. North of I-70, where the clouds have cleared out a little bit quicker, Temperatures a little bit cooler. 23 right now, Vandalia, Brunswick, still holding on close to 30 degrees for Sullivan, otherwise mid to upper 20s here across the area at 5 o'clock. Here is a live look right now over Jefferson City. You can see clouds in the distance, but clearing skies just off to the northwest on our Scruggs Lumber camera. 28 degrees right now in Jefferson City with winds out of the northeast at 7. Makes that wind chill feel like 21 degrees. A few areas of some light showers, a little bit of a wintry mix, and even some snow showers through the Ohio Valley out into the Mid-South. Quieter skies behind it, however, much colder and even some chillier conditions. High pressure will continue to build in, and that will allow for a chilly start to the work week here. The hour-by-hour -hour forecast continuing to show clouds across the area overnight. As we go through the day on your Tuesday, they begin to thin out. Looks like we might find a partly cloudy, even a mostly sunny sky late Tuesday afternoon. Wind starts turning to the south, so temperatures tomorrow will be a little bit better. As we get into your Wednesday, I think we'll find a little bit more cloud cover moving in. High pressure continues to build in as well, so depending on where you find yourself uh, with a little bit of a boundary on Wednesday afternoon and evening, will dictate some of those temperatures Wednesday afternoon. As high pressure builds in areas across 50 Highway and North, I think you'll definitely be on the cooler side. Southern Missouri may find themselves a little bit warmer through the earlier part of the afternoon afternoon before high pressure begins to inflate or influence some of their temperatures. Clouds will definitely be on the increase towards the middle part of the week and we'll find chances for some rain, even a little bit of a wintry mix possible towards the middle to end of the week. Mostly cloudy tonight, temperatures right around 20 degrees tomorrow morning. You're going to want the layers. Wind chills will be back into the teens tomorrow morning. As we go through the afternoon tomorrow, I do think we'll find a little bit more sunshine. Still a cool afternoon. Winds, however, out of the south. That will make a big difference with some of these temperatures. Notice I think we'll climb into the lower 40s across the area tomorrow, so not too bad. Here is that seven-day forecast climbing into the mid-40s on Wednesday. Similar conditions, a partly cloudy sky. Then we get Wednesday night into Thursday. Clouds really begin to build, and I think we'll find a wintry mix as we go through the day on your Thursday. Temperatures will be a little bit cool. Areas around the lake, maybe a little bit more of a rain than it is a wintry mix, but right now it looks like this is a possibility of some sleet mixed with some rain. Then we get Thursday night into Friday. Temperatures will be on the increase. Notice Thursday morning, or excuse me, Friday morning, we'll find temperatures starting off above 32 degrees, so I think we'll find mostly liquid on Friday. A dry Saturday looks like right now, upper 40s, right around 50 degrees, not too bad. The um, Jefferson City JC's Parade will be on Saturday and then possibly another chance for some rain Sunday into Monday. Of course, living windows going on downtown this weekend as well. Lots yeah. of uh, holiday Events. festivities going yeah. on in downtown Jeff City this weekend. And weather for the most part looks very cooperative. It's not going to be frigid. Doesn't look like a dousing of rain, maybe a few sprinkles on Sunday, but Saturday right now looking pretty good. That's good. We've been in some parades where it's just downright frigid. Yep, so. and wet. And we'll be there this weekend. We will. All right, thanks, yeah. Zach.